song to touch on our soul today. We are hearing lyrics on the radio in different areas of society that speak to inciting violence against, against agents of the state and citizens of Jamaica. I have listened to one recently where there is an explanation about the beast, about the police with the speed of gun. But I can tell you, colleagues, rank and file population, I encourage you, ensure that you stay alert, stay quick, look out for the beast, the drug and the code, because I encourage you to execute your training well. You have the full backing of the police federation to do so. And I call on the legislators to seriously and take this as an emergency call from the Jamaica Police Federation to look at acts where persons incite violence about shooting out barrels of citizens of Jamaica and young children and agents of the state to charge them criminally once they are guilty. Lock them up. We need laws to deal with that because if we don't do it, we will stand on platforms like this and talk and talk and talk. So the more we talk, the more things remain the same. We need back Jamaica. We need back a country with newness, a new vision, and a transformational mindset. Recently, I viewed the Jamaica 62 celebration. And I was in awe, especially being a female of the Jamaica Constabular Force. Congratulations and commendations to all the females who are celebrating the 75 years milestone. However, I saw drones, 1,000 drones making the faces of Miss Lumiere, so rest in peace. But Molly made it so rest in peace. But what vividly come to my mind is that. Can you imagine if the Jamaica Constabulary Force is equipped with 1,000 roads and the 19 geographical division makes 50, 50 each, that is 950, plus you have 50 in reserve in the event of a territory union incident? No gunman, no guy, no boy would escape in your bushes. Because whilst we have the joint military patrol on the ground, we have our technology, Dr. Blake, in the sky, following them left, following them right, following them backwards, following them forward. We kept a picture. We kept up everything that is evidential. We mean to help the police, to police Jamaica. We need that. I didn't want to go there, but I remember that fateful day after I concluded a meeting with the Central Committee, we got the call and we rushed to the Kingston Public Hospital. And we realized on the left, we saw our dear beloved colleague. And on the right, we saw another image. It is painful as a police federation when we go to hospitals. And the man who just shot the police is on the same ward where the police is being treated. And the Jamaica Police Federation used this symbolic occasion to renew the call for a protocol to be developed for service men and women in public hospitals.
I know that at this funeral service, we will see great things thereafter. To know that I declare it, I spoke it, and I'm waiting for a delivery of the Rebel Minister Commissioner for drones. We can have a joint military drone patrol or a police drone patrol, but we need to be up in the air. The 19 years geographical divisions need to be equipped. We want good things to happen. And I encourage those who are gathered here and those doing on the ground.